Hey YouTube, I'm Jeremy and it's time for your Two Minute Tools. Okay, today we're going to take a look at the MSK-10. This is a 10 piece stud remover and installer kit. Let's go ahead and see what's inside. So here we have it folks, this is the inside of the case. Like I said, it's a 10 piece SAE stud remover and installer. This is also available in a metric. Part number would be MSMK10. And let me show you how this works. The top ones, these are installers, and them are all thread specific. So you can read on here 3 8 by 24, 3 8 by 16. So this goes from uh, 7 16 to 5 16. And then the bottom row, these are all the removers. And then up top, there's an Allen wrench that you use with the installer. So on the installer, on the inside, you can see there's a little ball bearing inside of there. And then on the back side, there's a hex nut. And we'll use that Allen wrench. And what we do is we're going to tighten that ball bearing onto the stud. And I'll show you. So this is the proper size. Here's our stud. And we thread it on there until it's on snug. And then we use the Allen wrench, and we can give that just a little turn. Now this stud is in there, it's in there real good. So you could use a wrench or a socket to install this. And once it's installed, you use this Allen wrench, bust it free, and it'll spin right off there really easy. So here's our remover that we're gonna use. This is a 5 16 by 24. You wouldn't normally take this off, but I wanna take it off so you can see how this is built inside. And what you would do is, when this is in the vehicle, you just thread this on and get as many threads as you can. It doesn't take a whole lot to get in there. The other part you would have left on there, but now you use two wrenches and you jam that in. And that's going to hold this stud real good. And then you can use a socket to back it out. A lot of my customers tell me they really like these for exhaust manifolds. Do you have other uses that you could use them for? Why don't you share with the group? I appreciate it. Put it in the comments down below. If you haven't already, please click subscribe if you like this channel. And we'll see you next time.